In this tutorial, I'm going to show you the steps to take to install and license Mendel Core. Download the latest installer from the Core CG website. Run the installer. Choose the right version of Mendel Core that matches the current version of Maya you're using. In this case, I'm going to pick 2012 64-bit. Make sure you install Mendel Core to the directory where Maya is located. After installation, take a moment to read these instructions. Now start Maya. You should see a Mentorcore menu at the top in Maya, and a message saying no license found. If you are using a node locked or evaluation license, use the following steps to install the license. Select the install license option in the menu. Browse to the folder where your license is located. Select the license and press open. You should see a message saying the license was installed. Now restart Maya. If you select the Mentor Call menu, you'll now see you have other options available. In the Render Globals under Mentor Array, you should see a Mentor Core tab or so. If you are using a floating license, use the following steps. After purchasing a floating license, you should have received your mentorcore.loc file as well as the license server. If we open up the license file, it should look like this. The first line refers to the machine running the license server. This just refers to the current machine, followed by its MAC address. Make sure this is correct, otherwise the license won't work. The last number is the port which we'll connect to. This number down here refers to the amount of licenses we have. Next, start the license server by running rlm.exe. If everything is correct, it should look like this. The license server also has a built-in web server for managing the licenses. Open up the web browser. Type in the following. First, the IP address or name of the machine running the license server followed by a colon, then the port number, which you can see here. The license server allows you to see what licenses you're running, as well as their status. Next we need to create a client license for other machines to connect to the license server. Create a new text file. Name it mentorcore.loc. Open a notepad and add the following line. First, host, followed by the name or IP address of the license server. For the MAC address, put any, followed by the port number, which you can see up here. Now start Maya. Under the MentorCore menu, select Install License, browse to the license we just made, and you should see a message like this. Now we can restart Maya. To check the license is working correctly, open up the Render Globals, switch to MentorRay, under the MentorCore tab, enable MentorCore. Make sure you're in the rendering menu and under the render menu at the top, render current frame option box. Make sure the verbosity level is set to progress messages and press render. If we switch to the output window, near the top of the log, we should see some messages related to mental core. This indicates the license checkout was successful. 
you should also see in the web server some messages related to the license checkout. For more information about licensing MentorCore, managing your license, and setting the license server up as a Windows service, see the licensing section of the documentation.